to pawn off on some sucker. Who? Wrong choice of words, my guy. at the people's issue boy blaze here back at you with another one of venomous reactions and today we got a little bit of a throwback with the fresh prince of bel-air and this is all the times jazz has got thrown out of the house <laughs> every time jazz gets thrown out of the house bro every time it is hilarious and it's normally due to either him hitting on hillary or making fun of uncle phil making fun of will or saying something incredibly outrageous <laughs> so we're gonna see all the times jazz has got thrown out of the bank's mansion or pretty much anywhere anywhere where he does something incredibly insane so without further ado oh you know what before that you know what try not to laugh to this one so whoo, i got this i got this so without further ado let's get it Volume, let's go. Will someone turn it up for me, please? Jazz, crank it up for me. Hmm. Oh, yes. Gotta Listen. love orchestration like this. Listen to the violins. Oh, he's waiting Beautiful. for it. Oh. The oboes will be coming next. <laughs> Good evening. Good evening, sir. So, young man, how'd it go at school today? I joined the poetry club. Excellent. I remember when I first got interested in poetry. So who's the girl? We do off rip. When do we eat here? We eat here later. You eat here never. Mm. Looks like you eat here often. <laughs> Two hours at the mall, and I ain't getting no girls. Well, what did you expect? You went to the mall with girl away there. Ooh. Got him. For your information, Hillary, Jazz here happens to be the master when it comes to cracking on the girls. Yo, the boy is irresistible. Sure, maybe during a blackout. <laughs> no chill, bro. Love to get a hold of you during a blackout. Daddy? <sighs> Tragic. I want my clothes back, Jazz. You set me up with a maniac, man. Your sister's the bossiest woman in the world. I know. <laughs> you know. Man, she gets on my last nerves. Ever since she moved out here, she's been hanging out at my place, bossing me around all the time. I had to pawn off on some sucker. Who? Wrong choice of words, my guy. <laughs> man, between you and a Humpty dance, I'm gonna have to get a metal plate put in my butt. Hillary, mm -hmm. your behavior at the club last night was completely unacceptable. Now, where I come from, Man has count for a lot. Now, I'm sorry to have to say this, but I simply can't sit here and allow this rudeness to continue. Do I make myself clear? <laughs> Jazz? Come here. Ooh, you about to get some action! Psych! That's not gonna work this time, Hill, darling. See, Uncle Phil went to the supermarket, so he's gonna be gone for at least a week. <laughs> what a stupid. Mom? <laughs> she went with him. Jeffrey? Ooh. <laughs> yes, Miss Hillary? You know the drill. <sighs> uh oh. Poor Jazz. <laughs> what does that smell? 
Oh, I'm sorry, Uncle Phil. I thought I was alone. Yeah, nasty. No, no, I don't mean that. <laughs> Smells like cheap cologne and fried chicken. I resent that. <laughs> Oops. You had the perfect camouflage, my guy. <laughs> Until I see some insurance Ooh. papers. You're not driving this car. In fact, what kind of idiot would sell a car without insurance? I resent that. <laughs> ah, the joke's on you, Mr. Banks. You can't throw me out, because I'm already outside. We've been beating around the bush much too long. Mr. Banks, Ooh. I'm willing to take Hillary off your hands. <laughs> James, would you prefer a Muslim or Viking burial? <laughs> I mean, she ain't getting any younger. I'll put a roof over her head and might be willing to look into a marriage license if she performs on the test drive. <laughs> Philip, get him. <laughs> you never learn, my guy. Ah! I, I don't have to, so I'm not going to choose, all right? Okay, okay, you know, because I'm your best friend, I respect your decision. Because I am your best friend. Peace, my best friend. <laughs> Some best friend? When you go to your car, you got to walk. What, don't you? Please, watch this. Yo, oh, Mr. Banks, Lord. my tubby judicial brother. Because somebody moves away from the family, that doesn't mean they break up. That just means that, you know, the family has to work harder to stay together. You understand what I'm saying? You look clueless. No. <laughs> of course. At least you're talking to me. Come on, of Jeff, course. You know you're always going to be my homie. <laughs> Why don't you say that in the first place? I did say that. Why don't you clean out your ears? Now, I know you ain't talking about nobody's ears. <laughs> oh. Hey, come on, man. Let's get down to the mall, pick up some chocolate. Look, could you do one thing for me? You know, just for old time's sake. <laughs> sure, no problem, man. <laughs> you know, Miss Banks? For old time's since sake. Since you had that baby, there's something different about you. <laughs> Character change baby. out the blue. Yellow. Isn't it beautiful? Oh, yeah. Jazz, this thing says Wendy Beth on it. <laughs> so, when you buy a wallet, doesn't it have someone else's picture in it first? <laughs> Jazz, you stole this pillow. It's the thought that counts. <laughs> <sighs> Right back at you, Hillicums. Oh, no, not this one. I'll be in the kitchen throwing up. <laughs> We're going to name our first son after you, Daddy. By the way, I thought we could get started tonight. <laughs> That's it! Jazz out. I might have the tables turned. Yo, kudos to James Avery for selling that throw out. Oh, rest in peace, Uncle Phil. But damn, I ain't gonna lie. That one almost broke me. Almost. Damn. Not bringing a naked woman into my house. Oh, no, no, you don't understand, Miss Banks. She don't come in naked. <sighs> Uh-oh. Yep. <laughs> Bought 
this for you. Uh, the two-part season finale. <laughs> Wait, hold on. What did he say? The false teeth. Why? Why, my Jazz? Grandma. She don't need him no more. I know that. Look. You're not getting any younger. This isn't good for your back. I brought this on myself. Yeah, you did. Ah! <laughs> I go gonna lie, man. The one where Uncle Phil gets thrown out the house. <laughs> that almost broke me, bro. But, yo, you gotta admit. <laughs> Every time Jazz gets thrown out the house, he, he brought it upon himself after doing something incredibly insane or stupid or saying something incredibly, incredibly insane or stupid. <laughs> More so of the latter. <laughs> uh, every time, every time you look forward to Jazz getting thrown out the house, kill you know, the crickets. Every time. <laughs> yo, yo, let me know which which one of the ah, which time you enjoyed the most of Jazz getting thrown out the house <laughs> on the Fresh Prince of Bel Air. Yo, let me know down in the comment section down below. And as always, thank y'all for tuning in. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this one. And don't forget to tell your peoples across the globe. Come kick it with your boys just one good solid time. Like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to share. Don't forget to click that bell so you don't miss a video from the kid. You heard me. And please feel free to follow me on social media right over yonder. And this is your boy Blaze here saying Chuck Daniels. And I will see y'all in the next video. And I'm out.